Surveillance video captures the moment a truck careens out of control, hitting a bystander before slamming into that pole. Uh, police said the truck's driver lost control when he was shot in the back of the head. Yeah, all of this happened this morning along Ralph David Abernathy Boulevard in Atlanta. Fox 5's Angelique Proctor joins us live from near the scene of that wreck. And Angelique, police say the driver was not targeted. That's right, Sine. They say he was not targeted. He was just merely driving down Ralph David Abernathy at the wrong time when a stray bullet struck him in the head. The surveillance video tells the story of a violent crash. Atlanta police say three men were arguing on Ralph David Abernathy at around 9.45 Thursday evening when one of them pulled out a gun. Regrettably, a stray bullet hit 42-year-old Tobias Thomas in the head. The video shows the co-owner of Inkwell Music Studios losing control of his pickup truck, then hitting a man, Umar Dia. One of the rounds appeared to strike a motorist in the head who was driving a pickup truck. He lost control of the truck and struck a pedestrian uh, near the corner of uh, RDA and, and Lee Street. According to Atlanta police, the gunman didn't pay attention to where he was firing, setting off a chain of events that ended with two innocent people hurt. Paramedics rushed Mr. Thomas and Mr. Dia to Grady Memorial Hospital. Leaving lots of damage behind, we found technicians making repairs to West End businesses. Meanwhile, Atlanta police are still looking for the men involved in the reckless shooting. Two of the individuals walked into a storefront. The third stayed outside. He produced a gun and fired a few shots. Now, this all happened in this very busy area right in front of the mall, West End. Police say if you have any information about this shooting, please give them a call. Reporting live in Southwest Atlanta, Angelique Proctor, Fox 5 News.